Hello, I am Michael George. In this lesson, you are going to listen to an Egyptian Arabic sentence. Then I'll explain it later. Let's get started. كنت بنزل في الشارع بالكاميرا أصور حياة النجم داخل بيته. كنت بنزل في الشارع بالكاميرا أصور حياة النجم داخل بيته. كنت بنزل في الشارع بالكاميرا أصور حياة النجم داخل بيته. كنت means to be. It is a verb in the past tense, so it means was or where, and it is conjugated to match the pronoun أنا. It's easy to guess the pronoun by looking at the word كنت because it is conjugated to match the pronoun. So usually subject pronouns are omitted in Egyptian Arabic. I gave it a white color because it is omitted. بنزل is a verb and it is conjugated in the present tense to match the pronoun I. Those two words form the past continuous tense. بنزل means to go down and you can use it in a sentence like this. I go down the stairs. Also, it means land or climb down. في الشارع means in the street. So the expression بنزل في الشارع means to go out of home or workplace and walk in the street. This character means with and الكاميرا means a camera. The word camera implies that he is a photographer. So he goes out of his studio or his office taking a camera with him and then he walks in the street. أصور is a verb and it means to capture or to record and it is conjugated to match the pronoun I and the character B is not used so it is a tenseless verb. A tenseless verb is used because the sentence is already in the past continuous tense as I mentioned before. حياة means life and it is a feminine word. El Nigm means a star and it is a masculine word. It means a star that is in the sky or a famous actor. Hayat el Nigm means the star's life or the actor's life or the actor's lifestyle. Dakhil means inside. Bait means a house or a home. This character is a possessive pronoun and it means his, so this word means his home. This part of the sentence means capturing the lifestyle of the actor from inside his house. I translated it as capturing the meeting, but this may not be an accurate translation. So the speaker says that he goes out of his studio, taking a camera with him, and then he walks in the street, capturing the actor's lifestyle from inside his house. Or he records the actor's lifestyle with his camera after entering his house. The speaker used the past continuous tense because his career was to visit actors and record their lifestyles. He did not visit one actor only. He visited too many actors because that was his job. So he did it many many times in the past. That's why he used the past continuous tense. We use the past continuous tense when there is a repeated action in the past. It seems that he is retired or he stopped doing it. He no longer visits actors' houses because the sentence is in the past. Let's listen to the whole sentence once again. كنت بنزل في الشارع بالكاميرا أصور حياة النجم داخل بيته. كنت بنزل في الشارع بالكاميرا أصور حياة النجم داخل بيته. كنت بنزل في الشارع بالكاميرا أصور حياة النجم داخل بيته.